Good morning again, YouTube. It is. Hi! I'm getting better. I'm working on it. It's the second day of our travels. <laughs> we, um. We had a decent hotel. Yeah, well. Yeah. Yeah, let's just call it, call it that. It smelled like Grandma's smoky blanket. Oh, uh, yeah. Um. But the view that I'm looking at right now from the parking spot on the top of this massive hill is actually pretty decent, and I will put a picture of that up somewhere probably right around here when I go back and edit this. <laughs> um, we are heading from Huntington, West Virginia over to Charleston, West Virginia to see what festivities they have going on. Um, we, what did we do yesterday? We made it into saw. Huntington. Yes. Um, saw a parade. Saw, we, to just in time to see the homecoming parade for Marshall University. Um, so that was pretty neat. Got really good Mexican food. Uh, yeah, got great Mexican food from this place called Margaritas. I think so. It was Margaritas um, something. Probably Margaritas. I think it was margaritas. Um, great Mexican food. It was it was fantastic. Um, and the size of the drinks they give you is just ridiculous. I should have gone with a, a bottle like you got. But no, I got like a fucking... Uh, <laughs> a giant frosted glass. It, it comes in pints? <laughs> She goes, do you want a large or a small? And I was like, yeah, sure, I'll go with a large. That one drink lasted me through the whole meal. <laughs> that does not happen. Um, so that was neat. Uh, drove around town for a bit. Um, then we went back to the hotel room, had some more drinks, hung out with some people that we met while we were here. And yeah, all in all, it was a good time. So... We're gonna go through town. I'm gonna try and hit the bank because I believe this is the paycheck that my rent comes out of. <laughs> so I'm gonna go pick that up before I go too crazy. Um, we're gonna grab some breakfast and we're gonna mosey on to the next town. So we'll talk to you all soon. Bye! Nope, find it, find it, find it, thank you. Hey guys, so Josh and I are here in Charleston. Uh, he's down there on the dock. He was following that boat behind me. Um, we just got into town. I mean, we left a while ago and we've been in Charleston for a while, but we decided just to kind of hang out at the hotel for a bit, so we didn't really do much yet. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna start wandering around town now and finding things to go do. Hi. A little late there. Hey there. <laughs> that, that, that's my new addition. I'm trying the hey there instead of the hi. Hey there. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. It, it's facing me. You're no, good. No. <laughs> I'm trying to get behind so, you. So, oh God, okay. Or not. It's gonna be like this all day. <laughs> so. Uh, yeah, that's the plan. We're gonna go wander around downtown and see what we can come up with. And this is my life now. So we'll let you know what we find. Cause yeah, we've been really lazy just kind of hanging out in the hotel all day right now. So that'll be a thing and I'll talk to you soon. Bye guys. Hey guys, we're back. I'm back. Josh is recording. So, we've had a few drinks, we're walking around, we were walking by the river earlier, which was really amusing and a lot of fun. Um, we found, like, this little hut area where a homeless guy had clearly been hanging out. I mean, it was, it was really cool, like, he had this whole setup there, and we only know it was a homeless guy because we found the sign that said homeless needs help, whatever the hell was on it. I really didn't read the whole thing. But, they weren't there. 
Otherwise, we would have done something for them because that's just the kind of people we are. So we did that. We got lost driving around in the mountains in like Whitesville neighborhood and we almost died because we almost got hit on these roads that were like the size of for one car only. And now we're just wandering around downtown and we found this statue with like no face and it's super creepy. But I absolutely love it. Like the faces, I mean the faces there but it's so melted off. This statue's been here a while. So yeah, we're just having a good old time. Hi, and bye. Hey guys, you can't see us. You can see his silhouette, but you can't see me. You can sort of see us, whatever. Anyway, it is 1040 at night in Charleston, West Virginia. We are sitting along the river, literally perched on a uh, degraded set of stairs. <laughs> I mean, the stairs literally no longer exist. We're sort of just sitting on concrete hill next to whatever river this is. We've had plenty to drink. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. He's gonna fall over and die. Now he's behind me on the sidewalk. Um. <laughs> we. We could not be enjoying ourselves more. I wish I could show you guys more of what's going on, but I, I'm recording on my phone and oh, I have limited memory on it. Oh, oh, he's falling towards the river. Oh, God. You know what? His mistake is lost. Anyway, so... This city is beautiful. Everybody I've talked to here in West Virginia has said, why would you want to come here? We have nothing here. And they keep telling me, like, what is... Uh, they seriously, everybody I've talked to is, what is wrong with you? Why would you want to come here? There's nothing here to see. So on and so forth. But I'm having a great time. We went to a bar. We enjoyed a couple of drinks there. We have bought drinks for ourselves and been having a few drinks here and there of those we've been walking around the downtown area um it's just a beautiful city we've met really interesting people we're having a great time um i i don't i can't rightfully explain it to you guys and i'm sorry that there's no good angle for me to record for you guys to actually see me and see my face. Um, Josh is down there doing something. He's created a beacon for himself. <laughs> He's standing under his own spotlight. Um, I just... I don't know, maybe it's because I lived in Michigan for so long, maybe it's because I don't get out enough in Ohio where I live now, but just being able to like take in some place new and being completely free of work responsibility, family responsibility, right. out in the world I'm good. where I've always wanted totally to explore good. and just okay. be myself. Oh dear God, he's, he's going to drown. He's going to trip and he's going to fall into the river and he's going to drown. He's, he's below me. He's trying to figure things out. Hey. So that's probably what you hear in the background. Okay. <laughs> 
which is his problem, not mine, and it's hilarious. You take that back. But... <laughs> Oh, guys, I wish you could all be here with me sharing this experience. This is just one of many that I hope to go on. I mean, I'm... At this point in my life, I'm almost 30, and I feel like I missed out on so much growing up, but now that I have jobs where I can pay for everything myself and I can take the time to go out and enjoy life like that's what I'm doing I'm exploring the world which is something I've always wanted to do welcome back by the way oh, Jesus he made it back up the hill you can't see him you can't see me it doesn't yes. matter well, I mean, but we are both here and just this is this is what I've dreamed of my whole life and I hope that at myself and my brother Josh here that we can continue to do this. Um, so this will probably be it for the night you're covering the camera with your hand. It's over there. He's turning the camera towards the river. Like that's just house lighting along the river. And this is where we've perched for the time being. Over there's a bridge. To the left, that all that lighting is a bridge across the river. If you turn the other direction, there's another bridge with less lighting on our right. But I mean, this is this is where we're at. This is what we're doing. This is what I've wanted to do with my life: is just travel and see things like this, and enjoy the beauty of everything that nature has to offer. So, we're going to try and get a little closer to nature tomorrow with whitewater rafting. At least that's the plan. Until then, wherever you are in the world, I hope you're having a fantastic time. I love you. Thank you all for tuning in. This is going to be spliced together with some more stuff, so this is not the end. But I want you all to know I appreciate you. Josh appreci appreciates you. And we will see you all in the morning. So, good night for now. Talk to you in a bit.